Oh, I think he's uh, the person who could uh, win probably quite easily if Trump is the, is the nominee. The difference between 2016 and 2024 for Donald Trump, he only won with 43% of the vote in 2016. It was a vote that was decided in the Electoral College by some 78,000 people in three Midwestern states, about as many people as you put into a, a football stadium. And 2020, uh, he's going to have a hard time assembling that same coalition that brought him victory in 2016 because he has alienated uh, women in the suburbs. Certainly, uh, the, the Republican Party has in terms of the party's position on, on abortion. And then the character issue with the, the president is on trial, as you mentioned, for rape. And uh, women don't like him. <laughs> and, 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 and women are... Uh, a very uh, majority force, really, in, in, in this country. So I don't see how he can duplicate his victory. As, as for President Biden, his instincts seem really good. He won in 2020 after a very slow start in the primaries, and all of a sudden uh, his centrism, his bipartisanship kind of mm -hmm. came through, and he, he won the middle. He won the independents, which are a critical slice of voters in this uh, country. And his announcement video re is reclaiming the word and the concept of freedom, which is something that the Republicans have run out on traditionally. But now they're banning books, and they don't. Uh, they want to take away a constitutional right to abortion, and uh, so uh, the cultural issues are now favoring uh, the Democrats, which is a, a, a change of turn as well. And Kamala Harris. Um, People think or people say, critics say, she's not a strong uh, vice presidential contender. She hasn't really filled uh, the job. Mm. Uh, I think the Democrats are ready for that fight. I think you're going to see more of her out there. And, you know, she represents uh, the future. Mm. And uh, a lot of young people in this country uh, look to her as a role model. And and uh, mobilizing yep. the young vote in this country is really critical to Biden's reelection. You don't find too many young people who are Trump supporters, and uh, mm -hmm. he 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 is he is going to have to, I think, re retailer his campaign mm -hmm. away from the grievances that he was somehow cheated out of a second term that he didn't win yeah. to find his vision for the future. Right now, he draws a very uh, draconian uh, picture of of the future, right. and. Uh, that isn't the, an accurate picture of America today.